mobile devices uh, allow learners to learn outside of school, virtually everywhere, mobile learning, communicate and share learning experiences, explore and enhance the real world, and provide insights about their learning processes effortlessly. <laughs> Learning analytics, so mobile learning and learning analytics is the researcher's dream. Uh, besides with HTML5, we can uh, get some insights about the context of the learning processes. The orientation, uh, microphone, camera, battery and network information, uh, does the lack of battery or cost of the network access or, or disrupt the learning processes. We can use local storage to, to know what happened and when uh, the student was offline and there are even drafts of the standards to get uh, information about ambient light, temperature, humidity and so on. But it's also used as the uh, 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 previous presenter said. We, uh, learning analytics privacy issues is not only about user I, 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 using user IDs for anonymization. Uh, there are profiling techniques to uh, recover the, the relationship between real users and user IDs. And we, we, we don't have to treat the students as mere sources of data. The, the key point here is, as the previous presenter said, who takes advantage for your learning uh, analytics study? If the answer is not your students, you are using them as tools. So the goal is to, to get a, a scenario of mutual trust uh, to benefit learning processes. So it's a difficult balance. We are conducting now a, 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 a study about these using HTML5 technologies to, to gather um, insights about uh, learning processes. And this is uh, the project Codetu and, and to uh, gather some information about uh, learning how to program simple things. And the, the key point is to to, to inform the participant that uh, she or he will be uh, uh, in, a, in a study, participating in a study, and the, the study is voluntary and anonymous. And the data will be analyzed as a whole, no, not individually. So here is our study. We, we modify uh, um, Blockly. It's a program uh, to, to build things uh, easily with drag and drop uh, interfaces. Uh, and we are using those HTML files to gather information. We are using uh, user IDs and timestamps and so on, but we are not gathering any information about the, the person. Um, so uh, we are trying to figure out how to do this properly. And properly not in terms only of technical issues, but also on ethical issues. 